We knew this day was coming, and it's now here. We're getting some big reports about the streaming war, and I can't wait to break it all down. How's it going guys? It's Dylan from Anything Super, and if you're new, be sure to subscribe with notifications so you stay up to date with all the latest entertainment news. So just a few days ago, you might have heard something, but I'll say it again here because it sets the stage for today's main news. About four days ago, Disney Plus hit 95 million subscribers, meaning they're halfway to Netflix's count in just over a year of existence. That was huge, right? This is even bigger for the streaming war. According to this projection, Netflix is going to lose its number one spot. I'll explain what it means and why we think they might be wrong. This is a report from MediaPlayNews.com. Let's read what they say here. In the rapidly changing home entertainment ecosystem, 2026 seems like a long time in the future, but that's the time subscription streaming platform Disney Plus is projected to pass Netflix in the number of subscribers, according to Digital TV Research. The UK research group, which is basing its estimate on December 2020 fiscal results for Disney and Netflix, expects that the number of subscribers to Disney Plus at 294 million will overtake Netflix at 286 million in five years. Much of that growth will be driven by India, the world's second largest country in population. Disney Plus ended 2020 with 30% of its 95 million subs originating from India. Even if Disney follows the trend a little less than expected and these analysts are slightly optimistic, there's no worries. They have an almost guaranteed streaming war win in a few years. In 2026, there's going to be an 8 million subscriber difference. While this news is good for them, it was not unpredictable. Nobody beats Disney in their content. Their originals are really good quality with big budgets, and their recognizable franchises are huge and wide-ranging. Here's a few you definitely know. National Geographic, The Muppets, Home Alone, Pixar, The Simpsons, Star Wars, Marvel, Disney Animation Studios, and so on. There's nobody out there that could top so many famous brands. So in a couple of years, you'll see Netflix be surpassed by Disney+, and we predict the third place spot will be reserved for HBO Max. Besides Netflix and Disney, they also have one of the best collections of material, including Harry Potter, Looney Tunes, The Matrix, Lord of the Rings, DC, Game of Thrones, and more. They are not quite as big as the top two will be, but expect them to climb to a third place in streaming when they expand out of the US. It'll be a competitor Disney might have to keep an eye on. Based on the current rate of growth, we think these analysts might be a little pessimistic too. I'd say a 2024 takeover time is more likely, but we'll have to wait and see. With more and more Star Wars and Marvel series in the works, Disney Plus is turning into a behemoth of a streaming platform, and it's really fun to watch all of these mega streaming services claw at each other. We know the future winner of the streaming wars, but it's going to be interesting to watch its rise and how it gets there. Don't expect Netflix and others to sit quietly and lose their high ranks. It's going to go into full overdrive, which is great for consumers. More and more content will be pumped out by all of them trying to win. Netflix might have to resort to doing weekly episode releases as well. Just a really fascinating report that I can't wait to watch unfold. It's gonna get bloody. Are you subscribed to Disney Plus, Netflix, or both? That's all I have for you guys today. If you're new, remember to slam the subscribe button because whenever new information comes out, we'll be reporting it. Also, feel free to follow me on Twitter at SuperAnything for all the latest updates right when the news breaks. See you all very soon. This has been Dylan from Anything Super.